Good morning. This is Ken Obasi. Leslie, I'm in my studio again and, and uh, going to do some artwork. I don't know how long uh, this video is going to be because I'm sort of running out of space, but uh, I'll try to get in as much as I can before I, you know, uh, I'm cut off, you know. I'm uh, working with another John Michelle Basquiat piece here. Uh, actually, this piece is done on a window. And, uh, you know, so uh, one of the reasons why I really love working with uh, John Michelle's style, you know, which I've been doing for quite a number of years, is, is I love working very spontaneously. And also, I like, uh, I love putting uh, symbols, uh, anagrams, or whatever you want to call it, uh, different things inside the piece in order to, uh, to basically kind of say what I want to say without being right in your face with it, you know. And, uh, and art is uh, a good way to express those types of things uh, in terms of... Uh, and uh, so uh, I've been working on this piece for a while and uh, as you can see uh, you know uh, I'm almost finished with it you know there's uh, maybe a few things that uh, I might want to do to it but uh, you know uh, generally uh, you know it's done you know so uh, you can hear hear my music in the background uh, uh, playing the piece uh, by uh, McCoy Tyner, one of my favorite uh, uh, piano players. He passed away last year, I think. Uh, you know, he used to play with John Coltrane and and many others or whatever, you know. So, uh, actually, this album is called Inner Voices. So, it's an album he done back in the 70s. But, anyhow, you know, uh, again, getting back to the uh, art, uh, again, you know, it's just, this piece is uh, a piece, again, inspired by uh, John michel but I, I'm, I'm putting my, my own, my own thing into it, uh, and, uh, you know, so, uh, and to you all who has, have basically followed my work, you know, uh, you know, you know what it's about, you know, and uh, so, you know, so let's, let's, let's get into uh, maybe uh, working some things here, and uh, before, uh, before I am cut off, okay, as you can see, uh, I'm uh, basically got the basic colors in, uh, you know, one, one of the things is, I love blue, and I've always, uh, excuse me, I've got a sip of coffee here. You know, I, I, and I always want to get a little bit of that blue. Uh, no matter what I do, and, and, and the blue that I love it's always kind of like a indigo uh, kind of blue. And you know, it's just that, uh, again, you know, uh, I kind of just kind of look over the piece and say, where, where can I put this blue at? You know, it's a kind of a dark blue here, so maybe you, you might be able to not even, even see what, I'm doing so what I'm going to do I'm gonna add a little bit of white with it so I can to lighten up the blue a little bit there we go And you know, you, you may ask, you said like, wow, why did he put it there? Well, you know, it's just that, uh, you know, as, uh, as you know, as 
you would work, uh, and it's no different from anything else. You know, it's just kind of like, uh, you know, you, you just find that something tells you to put certain curl colors. And this is and this just this is the wonderful part about it, you know, because because really, you you know, you are you working on that part where on that situation where something tells you, you know, I mean, you know, it's just that, and it's it's always beyond your intellect, you know, it's, it's just a feeling that uh, comes in and, and says, uh, yeah, put this right here, and put this over here, and you know, and, and, and let's see what, what happens. So, uh, And that's where I'm at with it. Yeah. Uh, here we go. Put a little bit. Now, uh, I, I love using, I love using uh, text in my work. Yeah. Uh, yeah, words. And, th and, in this piece, as you can see, you know, there's a pentagram here, you know, and uh, I got various circles which represent uh, various portals uh, or whatever, you know. But uh, I think I'm gonna, you know, th and this piece is, uh, has to do with those who sell out their spirit and their souls for for money or for fame or for whatever, you know. And I think I'm gonna call this piece, you calling me a sellout? And, uh, you know, and, and he, he has kind of that expression on his face, you calling me a sellout? And uh, so uh, I think that, uh, uh, we're gonna uh, kind of give it that uh, give it that name and give it that designation and uh, you know you as a you Yeah. Uh -huh. 